Welcome everybody to Map Break 3 Starlit Skies by the CTMC. I am TJ the Obscure with you. We just finished up Map Break 2 and I figured that we would go ahead and continue with the series with Map Break 3. Let's read the book and see what it has to say. 16 Wool Event Map created in just a single week. I, you know, I was, I had some free time while they were making the map and I really wanted to hop on and help out. Um... But at the same time, I don't want to spoil the map for myself, right? And But I, I don't know. I probably could have hopped on and helped out. Maybe I'll try to do that for the next one. Or even just, like, record. It would be cool to record the, the map creation process, I think. Only enchanted objective blocks may be used for the monument to use. At least easy, never peaceful, yada, 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 yada. Uh, do not use cheats. We got 14er, Gavstar, all those lovely, lovely people. Lots and lots of lovely, lovely. Even Render was in on this one, huh? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It keeps, <laughs> it keeps going. We got five different data packs involved. What is going on, you guys? There might be a texture pack, resource pack involved with this. I'm not entirely sure. I didn't really read things all that carefully. As I am known to do. <laughs> got a comment recently saying yeah you should probably work on reading things before you run into these areas but reading is not fun says the english professor um starter items let's go ahead and grab some items while we can you 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 and you and you and you and you uh yeah that should be good i think oh we got a wither flower is there do we have any secrets secrets in the in the starter area i like these little windows looking out that's right, this is a Sky Island map. Um, so the first map wreck, I believe, was like continental style. The kind of open world. And then the second one was the linear branching, and now this one is the kind of void islands style of map. Which, honestly, I think it's... Whoa. That is that is a really cool effect. There's like fog. There's like fog, you guys. How did they do that? That is freaking amazing. It kind of reminds me a little bit of um, Skyrim. I'm playing Skyrim right now because I've never actually beaten Skyrim, so I'm trying to finally beat it because I beat the Wither. Or not, not 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 the Wither. I mean the Witcher. I beat all these uh, Zelda, Breath of the Wild. I beat all these big open world games, and I'm like, why have I not beaten Skyrim? So I'm trying to finally actually beat the main quest and stuff. But, of course, before that I can do that, I have to beat all the side quests and find all the things. I just saw somebody appear and disappear. Hello, Mr. Head. Uh, there's a compass pointing in that direction. We will take the compass. Yeah, here's Skeleton. Probably down below is my guess. But yeah, I think these uh, Void Island style maps are probably my favorite style maps. Although, I do, I do like the... Um, what are you? Speed potion? Speed potion. Yes, of course, speed potion. I put it there for Ty. In fact, I would I wouldn't be surprised if Ty, the speedrunner, was uh was not responsible for that. Um, I like them when they're linear, though, not open world style, so that it's not. Um, I don't want to be confused about where to go. Basically, I know I heard a skeleton. Maybe he's up inside the little blimp thing, because that's kind of where we were hearing him, right? I need blocks, though. I guess this should work. No, I'm not hearing... Or I'm not seeing anything. Like It doesn't seem to be hollow. He may be up on top of it, though. And honestly, we should probably check up on top of it. Just in case there are any secrets up here. But I am fairly certain that we got the skelly up here. Multiple skellies, even. Which means there may be a spawner. Just fantastic. Skellies spawner right off the bat. They may be non range skellies, though. This, uh, this little airship blimp thing is a lot thicker than I thought it was going to be. And indeed, it's these skellies with the swords. I'm trying to figure out if there is... 
a spawner. I feel like there has to be a spawner, right? No, just some natural spawns, huh? Interesting. Golden apples and some ender pearls. They're just throwing the stuff at us left and right. Let's go ahead and do something like that. And we can get a better view of things too. Yeah, I just cannot get over this this really cool effect. I'm guessing that was um Is it Suso that does all the the visual stuff? I can't remember if it's Suso or Ace As Asymmetric. One of those two guys I think is likely responsible for the effect that we're seeing. Um, okay, let's go back down. Now that we have all of our ender pearls and stuff and golden apples. And let's see if we can actually find some action. Oh, I see a giant structure down below. I don't know what my render distance is on. Probably... Let's turn that to hard. I, I've gotten out of the habit of doing that. Somebody needs to remind me. I, you know, I have mornings free now because my daughter has officially started school. And I've been thinking about streaming in the mornings, but it seems pointless to me because I imagine that most people are busy in the mornings. But it would be cool to maybe do some stuff live and have that kind of instant feedback. And so that people could actually remind me to turn... <laughs> Turn hard on and stuff. Uh, you know, let's just pop it up to 20 and see, see what we see. See what we see. Well, that certainly changes things, doesn't it? Oh my gosh. Oh, I don't know what I just did. I hit F4. I don't know what that does. Um... That certainly drops our frame rate significantly, so we're gonna need to turn it back down. Especially looking over there is bad. But uh, this looks pretty, pretty darn impressive. Ooh, the zombie is trying to get to us. He is trying to find us. Can you not get over here? You cannot get over here. Poor guy. Where you go? He's running away. I scared him. Ha. That's a pretty funny. Alright, we are officially entering white wool, it looks like. Silver crab, it says. I guess they look kind of crab-like. Somewhat, and then that's taking us to yellow wool. We got creepers spawning, and I hear spiders as well. Guess we'll go ahead and grab the melon. I hope that we don't have to rely on it for too long, though. And I know that this creeper is around here somewhere. Oh, man, that scared me. Did that scare anybody else? It scared me. It scared me lots. Oh, blocks, you guys. Yes. And a better axe. And some dried kelp. And regen. Wait, what is it? Orange juice? Anti-scurvy orange juice. Juicy? Anti scurvy orange juicy. <laughs> you gotta market that, man. Um, leather and speed too. They're just giving us all the speed potions, aren't they? Do they want us to move fast through the map? Um, I guess this is white, so we want to be going here first. <laughs> Buried regrets, it says. Got it just in time. Let's check out stuff to our right. And we know that there's going to be another spawner here. You want to take care of that for us? He tried. He tried his best. He gets a, he gets a blue participation ribbon. So we probably want to be headed there, I'm guessing. They don't use the beacons in this one, huh? So I know in, um, gosh, which, ooh, was it Burnout Fantasy? No. It was the one, it was Render's other map, but they used beacons, and it was, so it was really easy, the open world style map, and the way that it's supposed to kind of encourage exploration didn't really work, because I knew exactly where to go. So this one isn't making use of 
the beacons, at least as far as I can tell, I think is interesting. Do we have any hidden creepers in the wheat field? No, just lots and lots of the wheat. I think that's probably a silverfish spawner. And I do hear lots of the skeletons too. Okay, well thankfully we got tons of food here. So we're not going to have an issue with that, I don't think. Dead man's... Something. We got a zombie trying to sneak out behind us. Light it up. And let's close the door give ourselves a little privacy. Is there a crafting bench in here, by any chance? No. And let's make our own so that we can craft some more armor. And give ourselves all the necessary protection. Please, nobody figure out how to climb down that ladder. Oh, who's that? Who is coming to say hello? That's such a deep, deep-voiced, lovely baritone. Efficiency, too. Oh, man, and a power one bow. I don't think I need this compass. But... Uh, nope, don't need it. You cannot, you're not allowed to do that, guy. Anybody else around? No? We're good? Alright. What is that? What is that? Since when did they add candles to the game? Oh my gosh. They looked weird. It looked like an iron chest plate for a second there. Light gray candle. Well, that's pretty cool. Can you hang them from the ceiling, maybe? From the chains? Why is this blocked off? How dare they? Okay, well, let's, let's maybe block it off. Maybe it's supposed to be blocked off. Hello? 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 Nope. Okay. Hey, what are you doing out there? Yeah, let's, let's, uh, we're gonna block that off. They can't open the door. They're not zombies. As far as I know. What are you? What on earth? What's that? Bark biter, it says. Ha! You guys definitely can't be climbing down this ladder. Bark biter, so they're like they're like wood eating spiders? Is that what they are? Hey, I have um I have the stuff. Oh gosh. No no no, we didn't want to do that. Oh gosh, okay. Um Destroy. Open the chest. I shouldn't have made armor. I hear a creeper, I think. Uh, here, we don't need the kelp. We don't need any of that stuff. I do need this though. Section one, I'm breaking one. Glow berries. This is a this is a brand new game, you guys. Brand new game. Um, this because ah, we'll just use the axe. Why not? Oh, who's banging on the door? Nobody's home. Please go away. What is this? Um. Ha. Ah. What are you doing up here, Mr. Creeper? Oh, gosh, she's still alive. He shouldn't be, though. Ooh, I'm a little, making me a little nervous up here. More golden apples. He's got all the golden apples, man. Uh, nope, we're good, we're good. Maybe. I kind of want to keep going up. What's further up, you guys? Things that will harm us? I am on top of the world. Not quite. We go even higher. Uh... Underwater stuff right off the bat. That's not cool. That makes me very upset. You know what we're gonna do? This actually looks like a little structure right here, huh? Thought it was just more sand, but I think that's actually a little building. And then we got the spider there. Can we make that jump? Let's do one more just to be safe. And let's 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 not make any torches because we don't have the necessary equipment. Can glowberries be used for anything? Maybe to make some torches or Glowstone or something? Please don't get us killed. Okay. 
It's just it's just these guys. Uh, that guy makes me a little nervous though. Just a tad. Run away, run away, run away. Keep running, keep running, keep running. What is in the building? Um boop. A boop. A boop boop be doop. We good? I think we're good. Cartography table. Some fishing poles. This looks odd to me. But I guess that's nothing. Just run on by. Uh, what do we got? Boats. Oh man, you're spawning in your friends. Not cool. Um, can we? Oh gosh, yes, you did it. You did it. Fantastic. Good job. Well done. We applaud your amazing effort. I feel like there's gonna be something underneath here. Uh, boop! I boop you with my axe. I boop your buddy with my axe too. Um, I don't like this. I don't like this. What on earth was that? Is he firing withered potions? Well, that was cool. He can just wither himself to death then. For all I care. Seems like there's probably stuff up above too. This is a cool building. I like the uh, the look and the layout. But the chest isn't easily accessible, you know? Oops. And gold. Well, we will certainly use the gold. Raw gold too. Three different types of gold, huh? Is that really necessary? <laughs> Do you really need to clog the player's inventory with three different types of gold? Be on. Ooh, beautiful sky again. I just kind of want to hang out right here on this little windowsill. We'll just live out our days right here. In fact, this is probably a good place to go ahead and end the episode. That's going to be it for me for today, everybody. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time.